we have an update to a story Fox 13 News first reported earlier this week. The level of the Great Salt Lake is projected to hit a new record low this year. Political leaders and environmental groups say they need to do more to save it and do so quickly. Fox 13 News political reporter Ben Winslow has more. I'm here at the Great Salt Lake and you can see obviously just how much the lake has declined with the news that the Great Salt Lake is projected to drop another two feet this year. Utah's political leaders are trying to move faster to turn things around. Ecological, economic um, and, and environmental impacts that that will have on the state. Lieutenant Governor Deidre Henderson will take a group of lawmakers and other state officials on a boat tour of the Great Salt Lake next week. To see firsthand what the problems are and to hear from the people who work there, who know what's happening there, what, what has happened historically, what is happening now, hear from them uh, so that we can figure out what we can do to help solve the problem. The Great Salt Lake has already shrunk 11 feet since it was first measured in the 1800s. Utah's Department of Natural Resources projects it will drop another two feet this year to a new historic low. It presents an ecological and economic catastrophe for the state with less snowpack, toxic dust storms, and billions in lost money and increased costs to fix a dried up lake. It shrunk as a result of water diversion, drought, and climate change. The environmental group Friends of Great Salt Lake says it should come as no surprise the lake is likely to break another record low. The group says we all have to do our part to responsibly address these extraordinary circumstances. Conservation right now is the most important thing people can do as we put together these longer term plans. The Utah State Legislature advanced a number of bills aimed at protecting the lake. House Speaker Brad Wilson, who personally ran a bill to spend $40 million to get more water into it, says in a statement to Fox 13 News, the legislature remains concerned and engaged in preserving and conserving the Great Salt Lake. It is a good thing we acted when we did because the challenge persists and may even be accelerating. The lake is a big ship to turn and solutions will take time to put into place and produce results. We will continue to look at policy solutions but it will take a concerted effort of all stakeholders and Utahns to make a real difference. Friends of Great Salt Lake is planning a summit next month to talk about the problems facing the lake and possible solutions to turn things around. At the Great Salt Lake, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.